Hi there, my name is Corey Luckner with First Class Medical, and today we're going to talk about the difference between continuous and pulse flow. We get this question all the time from our customers. A lot of people kind of they call us, they don't know if they need the continuous, they don't need that they don't know if they can use the pulse. Well, I want to be here to try to guide you the best I can to help you make your decision on which will work best for you. Now, when it comes to the continuous and pulse flow, the best way to really describe the two is the continuous flow is exactly how it sounds. You're going to hear that steady oxygen's always coming out. Uh, the best thing to compare it to is your stationary concentrator, all the home stationary big concentrators that are on the wheels. Those are all steady flow concentrators. So as continuous flow, their measurements are looked at as liters per minute. So when you get like a portable concentrator, like the Oxlife Independence, for example, this is personally one of my favorite uh, continuous flow concentrators, you're gonna be able to do increments of 0.5, so you're gonna get 0.5 liters per minute all the way to three liters per minute. So every minute you're getting that many liters. Now here's where it gets a little tricky. The pulse flow units, as they look very nice, like for example, the Inogen 1G4 here, they are only pulse flow units. Now, pulse flow, intermittent flow, sounds more like tss, tss, tss. So if you recognize like an oxygen, green oxygen tank, sometimes they have what they call a conserving device. That conserving device is only giving you oxygen when you actually breathe in through your nose. So when you breathe in through your nose, you're gonna hear that psh, psh, that's when you're getting the oxygen. Biggest confusion we get. Two liters per minute continuous is not the same as a setting of two pulse. Now there are customers of ours that can use a two continuous and can use a two pulse. Their oxygen saturation stay fine. But there are scenarios where there are customers that use a two continuous that cannot use a two pulse at all. The next part with pulse flow is a two setting of two on an Enogen 1G4 might be different than a setting of two on a Respironix Evergo. Just because they're settings for the pulse doesn't mean that they're given the same amount of oxygen per pulse or per bolus. So a lot of people then ask us, well, how do I know if that's gonna work for me? <clears throat> well, what I recommend is most customers, if you've been on oxygen before, have a tank. Um, most tanks, or a lot of tanks, We'll have a conserving device and you might be using that on a pulse flow. Make sure your oxygen saturation levels are up. You could talk to your doctor or, I mean, one of the benefits of shopping with us is you can try a pulse flow unit. If it doesn't keep your oxygen saturations up, we want to make sure that you are getting a unit that's going to work for you. So that's why we have our exchange program. So let's say you get your Enogen 1G4 here, it's not gonna work for you, you find you need continuous flow, we'll exchange it out and get you the Oxlife. Now, when it comes to these units, we wanna make sure that, you wanna make sure that you're getting the correct flow, steady, continuous, pulse intermittent that works for you. There's no reason to try to go for a smaller unit if you're not gonna be getting the end goal here, which is your oxygen saturation levels. So, as where the continuous may look scary and big, and all honestly, you all have a traveling cart and a handle that's very easy to travel with, just like a suitcase. And then when it comes to these two units as well, another thing we recommend to make the decision easier is we recommend to have your doctor fax us a copy of your prescription because then our respiratory specialist here can look at your prescription and really get to go based on that and let you know which concentrator would work for you and then we can make sure that we get that first delivery to your hands to be the one that's gonna stay with you for you to use. Now, that's basically everything when it comes to continuous and pulse flow. If you have any questions I didn't answer, please let us know. You can shoot us an email at info at firstclassmedical.net. That's the number one ST for first. Or, Give us a call, 1-800-520-5726. Our respiratory specialists are always here to assist you with any questions you may have. Thank you, and have a wonderful day.